city. Drag your asses out of your sad sack and turn to face the sky. Today and today only, you might catch a glimpse of the Crystal Palace, that big-ass space station in which you mere mortals will never set foot. Now, they say the Crystal Palace has the most expensive casinos, the most beautiful women, and some damn breathtaking views, but that's what they say about Night City. Heaven on Earth, heaven in orbit. What's the difference to stop the Earth and everyone does? No. Better find yourselves a nice high hill to go palace gazing. Yep, sir, you denizens of Night City's lower reaches. Life has screwed you over yet again. What? Couldn't wait for me? I didn't want to wake you. some crystal palace spotting the hell with that palace v i is everything all right you okay no i'm not okay nothing's okay fuck pan am i need air I know one thing. This fucking city. I will not miss it. I really can't understand it. After all that happened in Makoshi, you feel no need to leave this shithole? Just leave. Run and never look back. Run away with me. What would it change if I did leave with you? I only got a few months left anyway. It would be a few months among people you care about. People who care about you. Unless... Unless that's your point. You think the end could be easier? If you were alone? You know that's not true. I know this, V. Tomorrow I will be gone. We're breaking camp. We'll leave at dawn. Don't want to lose you, but I can't leave. I can't live or think any other way. Well, you know, I always set my radio to Stanley. Will I hear about you? You can bet on it. I so detest goodbyes. They had a saying in my clan. No goodbyes. Only roads that four can converge. Nomad say all sorts of shit. Speaking of which, you still owe me that story of that guy from Caucasus. One who rode in your trunk. I'll tell you. Someday. Somewhere. If our roads meet again. Till next time.
I will remember V. Always. Good morning, V. Hey, Del. Are you prepared for takeoff? The afterlife. Head over there. Your wish is my command. My, don't you look tired? Did you have a difficult night? Difficult few weeks. Success weighing you down. Is that it? I was under the impression you had gotten all you wanted. That you'd shown the city exactly who is top dog. Can I help? I'd very much like to help you. Honestly, it's too late. I can't be helped. You've unlimited resources at your disposal after your raid on Mikoshi. All of the afterlife eat out of your hand. I'm certain. Don't worry about it, Del. If you say so. Mood in the city. What's it like? Arasaka's problem has continued to compound. Organization disintegration. Its share price has collapsed. Public mistrust is at an all-time high. I could go on. the rich immortality, sold them on it, actually collected engrams and knowledge, and bid for control, for power, I say. In the street, rumors abound that you've taken on something rather big, and that one with great power and even greater funds is backing you. Nothing much besides. Arasaka is in chaos, striving to restore even a semblance of order. It seems you, the afterlife, are safe, for now. Good to know. May I ask you something, V? Shoot. You mentioned recently that only one thing matters to you. To gaze upon Night City from the very top. I hope your deep learning covered metaphor, and you're not about to tell me to exercise caution when looking out the window. Sarcasm. Funny. No. I wish to ask what will come next, once you've achieved your aim. I'll feel fulfilled. Truly? Sure fucking hope so. I've chosen the optimal route. We'll be arriving shortly. One last thing before I shut up as requested. Don't worry, V. succulent fruit.
V. I've long awaited this moment to look the latest afterlife legend in the eye. I must say, I'm moved. Happy not to disappoint. Sit, sit. Talk to me. Well, V. Mikoshi was quite the punch. You TKO'd Arasaka, in fact. Brought you Eddie's influence around town. But not just that. It meant positive paralysis of Arasaka systems. A few additional hatches opened up. My people rushed in, grabbed what they could. So it's all systems go for the op. I have confirmed the intel leaking out of Arasaka. The casino is currently testing a new security system. And it's true. They will be shutting it down briefly today. I believe you'll know how to use that moment. Won't be disappointed. Pick the best merc around for the job. So I've heard. But I'd like it proved to me as well. Speaking of which, nobody's ever pulled off a stunt like this. Where I'm from, they'd say it's straight impossible. They'd say you're taking too big a risk. Poetically speaking, flying towards the sun to burn up. They'd be dead wrong. All of them. Self-confidence worthy of a legend. Or of someone risking it all. <laughs> but I sense you know what it's like to lose everything. To fight for one last breath. I see it in you. This time tomorrow, should have the casino's client data. All of it. Don't forget your side of the bargain. Oh, I never forget a promise. Good luck. Right. In position. Perfect. Almost to the second. My turn. Hmm. Satellites are down for now. Just got the signal. Signature cloaking activated. Remember, got one shot and one shot only. Yeah, tell me something I don't know. As soon as it starts, there'll be no backing down. No chance at extraction. No chance of survival if anyone notices. Excellent. But if this works, you'll gain more than you ever imagined. Times when I had something to gain are long gone. Now, now I got nothing to lose. That's kind of grim. Then again, who am I to judge? Okay, here goes nothing. Good luck. See you down bottom. Over and out.
What's up, kid? Been a while since you came to see old Vic. I'll bet your tunes in the afterlife found you a new Major League Ripper, huh? Them swanky downtown fuckers shooting chrome out his ass? Am I right? Get all you can out of this life. You deserve it. More than anyone I know. But stop by sometime, okay? Next time you're in the neighborhood, we'll talk about old times and I'll take a look at you. Make sure that the new Ripper of yours didn't screw anything up. See you around, V. Everyone's telling me you're a, a big gordo now. A big shot, eh? <laughs> so big you can't call me once a week. Once a month even. Don't forget where you started. Who you started with, hmm? My door's always open to you. There's always food on my table. Mi casa es su casa. No se te olvide. Ahí te veo, Vi. And, um, 
You're one of us now, V. You're an Alda Caldo. Remember that. Ah, take care of yourself, V. And see you around. V, hey! Can you hear me? Shit, is this thing recording? Okay, well, all of us have been wondering when you're finally gonna drop by. We can get a barbecue going, knock a few back, do a couple of races, or pay a friendly visit to the Raff and Shiv. Guess what I'm trying to say is, well, Badlands could use a badass like you, V. Don't know what you got on your plate right now, but remember, you're welcome out here anytime. All right, now, take care. Hey, V, so, funny thing just happened. Oh, fuck, fuck, shit. Voicemail again. Do you ever answer the phone? Like, ever? Seriously. I can get through to data term customer service faster than you. <sighs> what did I even want? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know that us cracks agent called me and asked if I would go on tour with them? At first, I was like, over my dead fucking body. But then I thought, hey, wait. I could actually be fun. So, uh, what else? Well, there's the latest gossip for you, if you even care. Call me back when you can, okay? Peace out! to pay the price. 